The third week of testimony in the trial of former Mount Carmel doctor William Husel wrapped up earlier today. NBC 4's Dan Perlman joining us now live from the courthouse. One witness testifying today, right, Dan? Uh, that's absolutely right, Brad. And, you know, it was a witness who actually began testifying in this case last Monday. Go ahead and take a look at your screen. You can see Dr. Wes Ely on the witness stand today. He's an intensive care unit doctor in Tennessee who says he reviewed medical records for the 14 patients involved in this case. A reminder, Husel is accused of ordering fatal doses of fentanyl or fentanyl and other drugs for patients in his care. Take a listen to part of the testimony while the state questioned him today. On cross, you were asked, but for the fentanyl, could you predict when Joanne Belisari would die? And you answered, no, I cannot. Explain that to us. Well, I'm not God. I don't know when somebody's going to die. If I was allowed to give an answer other than yes and no, what I would say would be that I would be virtually certain that, that these people would have lived longer because I know that they had imposed into their life course a lethal dose of fentanyl, hydromorphone, and benzodiazepine. In the absence of those drugs, there would not have been a median time of death of 10, minute, 10 to 14 minutes after the drugs. These, usually we have people living for hours or days after we withdraw support. And the doses these people gave would not allow them to keep living. And there's also no other reason to give those doses unless you're trying to end the life of the person. I've never seen it done in my entire 30 years of medicine, ever. And Husel's defense team, as we've reported, does argue that he was providing comfort care to his patients. So as we stand here right now, the third week of testimony in this case is now over. So far, 22 witnesses have taken the witness stand. More testimony expected next week. Local for you at the Franklin County Courthouse, Dan Perlman, NBC4.